Hey everybody and happy day. Hopefully your week is going well as you anticipate Sunday, which is on the horizon. This week we're talking about Abraham and Isaac, and this is actually a pretty tough story to go over with kids. Why would God ask Abraham to do something like this? And um, the curriculum, once again, our goal is to point children to Jesus. And so there are two points that point children to Jesus. And uh, this story is an excellent pointer to Jesus as well. Um, The curriculum is very cautious in how it presents these items in an age-appropriate manner. But I would encourage you to pray as you prepare for your lesson and how you might present these heavy concepts as well. But the things to walk away with, number one, uh, God provided his son. And then I... Uh, and then God provided a substitute uh, for us. And uh, I love how the King James puts it. God, so Isaac asks his dad, hey, we've got all this stuff. What do we do? And Abraham responds, God will provide himself a lamb. Ooh, pretty amazing. Um, some scholars actually believe that uh, Mount Moriah where they went also happened to be Golgotha down the road. Uh, We don't know that for sure, but uh, definitely adds to the story if that is the case. So once again, um, our goal is to point people to Jesus and uh, our kids and ourselves. uh, Pray about this lesson. Keep on keeping on. You're doing a great job. Uh, I so appreciate you standing in the gap. Uh, You know, you look at the news, You look at life and it can be pretty discouraging, Uh, really no matter what perspective you uh, evaluate things. Uh, But the bottom line, God is on the throne and uh, he is entrusting these precious lives to us. So thank you very much. We love you. We're praying for you. And uh, it's going to be a great week.